हरे कृष्णा टू बी नाइस इज नॉट टू बी नाइव इट इज टू बी फ्री फ्रॉम द कंट्रोल ऑफ वॉइस नाइस पीपल ऑलवेज फिनिश लास्ट सच सेंग्स आर ऑफन यूज बाय पीपल टू डेनिग्रेट एज डेनिग्रेट दोज हु आर टू सॉफ्ट and to highlight what they consider as the impracticality of niceness however does this mean that in order to be successful in life we need to be rough and rude and crude no not necessarily what it means is that we need to reassess what being nice means if we think that being nice is is the same as being naive that means we start thinking that oh if we are good then everybody will be good if we behave well everybody will behave well with us if we don't understand that there are people who can behave who who can who are wicked and they can behave in brutal ways and even people who seem gentlemanly also have snakes inside them and those snakes can come at any moment and bite so we can't be naive if you are naive we will be exploited and we will be can even be destroyed so nice simply means that we are not under the control of vice that means we are not under the control of anger we are not under the control of vindictiveness we are not under the control of and we but we are respect we are respectable and responsible krishna talks about the godly people in the 16th chapter text 1 to 1 2 and 3 and there there in he describes in text 2 ahimsa satyam akrodhas tyagah shantir apaishunam daya bhuteshvalo luptvam mardavam rir achapalam so he describes ahimsa non violence satyam uh, they are truthful akrodhas that they don't get they not short tempered they not angry tyagah shantira paishunam they are peaceful they are ready to let go of things when necessary apaishunam they don't delight in finding faults they are averse to finding faults daya bhuteshvalo luptvam that daya bhuteshu that they are they are compassionate to others alo luptam they are free from greed and mardavam rir achapalam mardavam they are gentle they are modest and then achapalam they are steady so it's interesting here when krishna is bringing all these virtues all these can seem to be like soft virtues but then krishna tells arjuna just a few verses later मा शुच संपद दैवी अभिजात सिभारत दट अर्जुन यू आर बॉर्न विथ गॉडली नेचर सो अर्जुन इज गॉडली नेचर डिड नॉट मीन दैट ही वॉज नाइव वेन द कौरवाज वेर एक्सप्लॉयटिंग एंड वेर ट्राइंग टू एक्सटर्मिनेट एंड आई हेलेट देर होल ऑल द पांडवा ब्रदर्स इट इज नॉट अर्जुन वॉज नाइव अर्जुन वॉज स्ट्रॉग अर्जुन वॉज वाइज अर्जुन वॉज shrewd so when we have to consider ni- uh, niceness we have to redefine it as different from whatever our preconceptions that might equate nice with naive is when krishna describes the ungodly people he describes them primarily as being controlled by vice being short tempered being violent being abusive being arrogant so the idea is that anger can also be a power if it is argued directed properly and in the appropriate occasion so the pandavas fight when required and that is not impelled by anger and that is not considered violence because it is for the purpose of dharma so if we are controlled by anger then we will get angry even when we don't want to if we are naive then we can't get angry even when we need to so Uh, when we are not controlled by vice then we can be nice that means we can be gentlemanly and we can be firm when necessary so 
this balance of being of being nice and being free from vice this can be arranged when our godly nature comes out and our godly nature comes out best when we connect with god arjuna is a devotee and thus he can be free from vice and be nice thank you hare krishna